Whitney Lewis was born on August 13, 1985. He was born in Corpus Christi, Texas, but grew up in Oxnard, California. Lewis grew to be a 6'1", 200-pound football star. In one season, he rushed for 1,000-plus yards and had 1,000-plus yards receiving. He was the first high school player in California to do so. In another season, he had over 30 receptions, averaging 20 yards per catch. In high school, he had offers from top schools such as Florida State, Tennessee, Miami, Texas, Oregon, Arizona State, and USC. Despite his strong interest in playing at FSU with his best friend, Lorenzo Booker, his parents refused to sign his letter of intent to play there. Because of this, he was forced to go to USC. The coaches at the time were Pete Carroll and Norm Chow. They wanted to use Lewis as a utility player and had him playing various positions like receiver, tailback, and fullback. Lewis had only wanted to play his position, which was receiver. In 2003, he was a true freshman and in the season only gained 38 yards. He then redshirted in 2004 because he was deemed academically ineligible. When he was a sophomore, he was moved back to receiver, but didn't catch a pass in nine games. After his unsuccessful career at USC, he transferred to Northern Iowa University, hoping for better. He had two years of eligibility left, and in that time, there was no information on how he performed there. Whitney Lewis never got drafted or played in the NFL, despite being considered one of the best high school football players. Whitney Lewis was an outstanding high school athlete and was considered one of the best. He had great potential and was expected to go all the way and play in the pros, but he unfortunately did not. When finding information about Whitney Lewis and reading about him, many articles say that he was in the top five worst recruiting busts in the decade. Whitney Lewis's high school football highlights So a player who is strong, athletic, and capable. So it is extremely shocking that he was not able to go to the NFL.